So what's up guys my name is Sambut Banerjee and welcome back to Let's Play The Wolf Among Us Part 2. So the last time where I left the game we saw that the stubborn woodsman was trying to be the superhuman big bad wolf aka big bay wolf and as we thought that his ass was to get kicked on he was helped by the girl named Faith who happens to be uh, how should I put it? Um, sex worker. Yeah. So without uh, talking too much, I will get back to the game. And yeah, like every day, every of my last videos, I like to thank Molly Love for introducing me to making videos on YouTube and giving me suggestions on how to make it. And yeah, do go and like and subscribe his channel and also my friend FC Bagon's channel. So without further ado, let's play the game. No, to last time where I left it, there was. I didn't actually watch the intro, so sorry that you have to watch it. <laughs> Please don't get angry and keep a little. What should I say? Um, be a little patient and just watch the video. So, thanks to everyone who watched it. And yeah, I got 15 views from the last video. Yay! So, I found out this option that I can stop recording whenever I like to. So, I skip the videos for your convenience. And sorry for the noises at the back. My, some works are going on in my home. So, let's see what do I have to do. What's this? I'm going to skip and just go straight into my home. Sorry that the game lags, it's actually not my system, it's Panicam. I don't know why the game's lagging. Sorry. What does this what does this one say? Sometimes be a disciplinarian. Who's that? Stay of the grass, I There's no walking on the grass, no white's orders. She made a sign and everything. I'll be sure to send her an apology. Beauty. So Hello, it's beauty or beauty and the beast, I suppose. I wasn't expecting anyone. I know this Why looks you a little late? odd, but there's an explanation. Oh, I swear. Are you going? You're out pretty late. Is there some sort of curfew I don't know about? What How rude. Degree? I just asked her why she I'm was late. out. Please, Bigby. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. And why is that? Much as it, is, blah, blah. And it would just make my life a lot easier. Sure. Okay, I promise. Thank you, Bigby. I'm welcome, lady. To you later. I will, but I have to go. Yeah, you're beautiful. Thank you for trusting me. Really, I I appreciate Bigby. As I previously said in my last video, I should say this cell shaded game, the cell shaded, the shell shaded feeling in this game really looks nice, and it goes really good with the the comic type of comic type of graphics. And I, I must say, I'm really enjoying this one. I actually I completed it before, and I'm replaying it for for making the video. 
And let's see. I should check my mails. Been a while since I got any mail. And sorry for my stammering problem. I really Seven should improve that one. <laughs> Now why is this one sleeping? Oi, get up! Hey, you wink? Of course he's not awake. Can't you see? Mm, probably for the best. Not going to touch that one. Um. Damn thing fell off again. He's that poor that he can't even buy a nameplate for the board how much longer is this gonna go on Bigby, hey, wait up. Who's Have this? Have you seen my wife? Have you seen Beauty? Is this beast? Uh, as so, I promised. Have you? I haven't nope. seen her. I haven't seen her. Oh, okay. Sorry to bother you. Damn it. Something's going on. What's that? Tell me. Hey, tell me. The door closed. I don't know how long this ep this video series will go on, maybe 28, 30 parts. I don't know, it depends on how long the videos are and I'll try to make it the traditional 30 minutes or 28 minutes ones. So that people don't get bored and see it. Especially my friends. Damn. Should've cracked a window. We know, we know. Thrown out of a window. Being beaten by the stubborn woodsman. Ah, it was a good night, I think. Let's check the refrigerator. Why do I even own this? Should have got a smaller one. You know why do you own that one? And yeah, smaller one was convenient. And this was cheap than this one. Check who's Bluebeard. I don't know. Bluebeard's file. Never trusted this guy. Don't even remember ordering that. Probably a bad sign. Uh oh. Now what's gonna happen in here? Whoa! And who's that? Uh, oh, hey, Big B. I'm in your chair, huh? Yeah, you are. I'm tired, Colin. It's been a long day. So, it's calling off three little pigs? Yeah, I remember Big Bad Wolf was in that story too. Yeah, he blew away their home with a puff and puff. <sighs> like that. Got a smoke? So, a pig smokes? Wow. Thanks. 
Couple thousand more of these, we'll be even on that house you owe me. And there's a reference to this the house. This has gotta stop. You can't keep sneaking off the farm like this. The fresh air and sunshine pitch they sell you on is bullshit. I didn't escape out of the homelands to end up in some prison, okay? Don't send me back there, Bigby. You don't know what it's like, okay? You haven't been there. Come on. That's a little dramatic. That for me? Nope. No? The house didn't blow itself down, Bigby. That's all I'm saying. Do with that what you will. Now, I'm not saying it's reason enough for me to have definitely been offered a drink, but, uh... It would have helped ease some of the pain you once caused me, yes. It also would have shown everyone how different you are now. If that was all you were saying, I'd be able to get some rest. I take it all back. This is why everyone hates you. Fuck you. It is better to be feared than loved. You know who said that? Yeah, some sad asshole. Eating alone. But, uh, no. Um, hate's the wrong word. They fear you more than anything. You ate a lot of people back in your day. I thought we were all supposed to have a fresh start here. I can't change the past. Well, you can't change people's memories either. Look, I'm not saying it's fair, but it's real. People are scared of you. I mean, look at your hands. Who'd you get in a fight with? A fable, right? I'm sure you're not going around punching Mondays. I was doing my job, believe it or not. Your job is to beat the shit out of fables? Sometimes I take them to the farm. Fuck you. Lol. You think my job is easy? You try keeping a bunch of fables from killing each other. How do you think this all works? I don't know. How? By being big and being bad. By being big and being bad. Don't say that shit in front of people. It's embarrassing. That's the attitude that gets you in trouble. Voice I'm sure you were really shitty good. to everyone you came I across must say. tonight. Mm, not everyone. Name one. Beauty. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I told her I'd lie for her. Right. Yeah, that's real nice of you. I think I made a wrong choice. Oh shit. Life is easier with friends, Bigby. And we live a long fucking time. I know you like this whole lone wolf thing you got going for yourself. But I've seen the way you look at snow, okay? You're not fooling me. Will you shut up? Well, maybe so if my throat wasn't like so parched, I wouldn't have to keep talking. Wait, that doesn't make sense. Just give sense. me a drink, please. Colin, enough already. Stop begging. I haven't slept in two days. I went out a second story window and I want to get in two seconds of shut eye before I. Look, if I give What's you this, the puppy you eye? let me sleep. Yeah, yeah, all right. Probably. I want to sleep. I think he's tired. After we thrown out of a two story building and been beaten up by the woodsman. Thanks, Big B. Yeah, yeah, you're welcome. I'm coming, I'm coming. Will you just stop knocking already, whoever you are? Big B! Snow? So Come this with is me. Snow White. Snow. Snow! What? Sorry, I'm... What is it? What happened? I just can't get into it this second. We need to hurry to... 
Hi. Hello. Good morning. Or evening. <laughs> that guy looks yeah. like an asshole. Fuck you! These walls are paper thin. We need to be careful. We'll talk outside. Snow's unhappy because the security guy's jacket's lying out there. Come on. Let's grab it. I want to wear that one. I want to wear it. Grab it already. Grab it! Don't give those looks. What is it? Grab it! Oh shit! Oh shit! You fuck! Knew Who this girl? Killed her! Is Who killed her? She's not a Monday, right? Who was she? I thought I knew everyone in Fable Town. A working girl? A working girl? I don't... I mean, I'm a working... Oh. The woodsman. He attacked her and I stepped in. And he threatened to kill us both. No. You don't think he... Yes, he... Yet. Just give me a second. It's just... Terrible. Who found her? So, who found her? I did. She was just like this. I didn't touch her. I grabbed that her was jacket to cover her with. Idiotic question, then I think. I, came to get I asked her. No one else was with you? No. Big P, did one of us do this? There hasn't been a murder in Fable Town in a long time. All the more reason we shouldn't start a panic before we know what's going on. Have a look around. We don't have much time before people will be coming through here. Let's check her lips or my head. She yeah. was placed here with some care. What do you mean? You can see that someone didn't just toss her here. She was deliberately placed for us to find. What kind of monster would do this? Let's check the neck. Strange cut. What did this Ew. to her? What could do something like that? Either something very sharp or something with magic attached to it. Or it could be both. Not, I know I'm not doing anything malicious. What is? There's something sticking out of her mouth. It's her ribbon. There's some kind of symbol here. Huh. I I don't recognize it. Neither do I. I think we should check the surrounding. I'm, I'm sorry. This is just so surreal. <sighs> um, what, what do you want to do next? Ah, the music is really nice. We still have some time. I should keep investigating the area. Okay, good idea. 
the music adds to the feeling That stain was blood. there. I'd say it's been here an hour, maybe. Is he an idiot? So, does he think that it's the ketchup? Of course, it's blood. There are three highlighted places. Let's check the trash can. There's some loose trash. Fence post. Blood. Yeah, blood. Still wet. Sharp enough. Fabric. Looks like jeans. Doesn't tell me much. So let's get to Yeah, hey, she talked not. with her. You alright? No, she is. Yes. Thanks. But you should hurry. We don't have much time. She left. is? We should head back inside soon. Compare the fabric with her. Who knows? She might be the mother murderer. What are you doing? I was Better sneaking up your skirt. Sure, just hurry up. We don't have much time. Cover it already. Move her before anyone shows up. We'll find out more at the business office. She'll be in the books. I'm sure of it. So Baby, they are both. Do you have any idea what's going on? How did uh, this happen? Why her? I think it's a message. This is a message. That I've come back and I'll message. kill everyone. I don't know, Bigby. I get complaints at the office all the time, but. That kind of a person, just I think. Just what about this makes you think that? Whoever did this isn't exactly hiding it. The placement of the head, it's exact, purposeful. She was placed here precisely for us to find. All of us. Well, yes. I guess you're right. The killer wanted us to know what they had done. Just cover it already. It's sick. I'm gonna have to tell Crane about this. As long as King Cole is gone, he's acting mayor. He needs to know. And he's going to find out anyway. So we may as well get okay, out in front do of him. What you It'll need just to. be worse if he finds out we held it from him. I guess it's useless to drag it out. That's how I feel too. I'm sure he won't be happy, but it's just part of the process. Hopefully he can be rational about it. I wouldn't hold my breath. <sighs> I'm not. I just don't want him interfering. Me too. Crane's not what's important right now. We need to figure out who this girl was so we can find whoever did this. Take this back to Dr. Swinehart. He can take a look at it. I'll meet you at the business office. What are you, blind? Who's that asshole? Oh, you don't see there's a line? I've been standing here a half hour already. You get to just walk in? Must be nice being the sheriff. Do whatever the fuck you like. I work here. And what great work you do, sheriff. Hmm. That didn't feel very genuine. Fucker. Yeah, you are the fucker. Because you are the one bringing this to me, Miss Snow. The one who so simply stumbled upon the asshole? catastrophe on our very doorstep. The last thing I need with Mayor Cole away is a hysteria. Do you understand me? 
Yes, of course I Don't do. interrupt me, Miss Snow! You asked me a question. Don't change the subject. You are to blame for this unpleasantness, Miss Snow. I brought you this news as soon as I could. You are trusted to keep things running smoothly around here. This is a disaster. Back off, Ichabod. It's not her fault. I don't need your help, Bigby. Instead of trying to assign blame, maybe we should figure out how to catch the fucker who did this. Oh, says the man who is most to blame for this catastrophe. How convenient. Sheriff, you are the one charged with protecting the citizens of Fable Town. Your failure to do so cost someone their life and the safety of the entire community. Tell me you've been doing something. Are there any leads? Suspects? Anything. Anything at all. Any shred of evidence you two know what the hell you're doing. Yeah. Her pimp. Her... was she a... Yeah. She was worried about a money situation. Well, this is just wonderful. Not only is a fable killed, but it was a fable hooker to boot. You two need to get a handle on this situation quickly and quietly. The last thing we need is all of Fable Town knowing there's a killer amongst us. Snow. Yes? Sir? Call Vivian right this minute and let her know I'm coming in early for my massage. I will. Where is the bottle of wine you were to purchase? Don't bother. Forget it. Can't do anything right. Do your job, Sheriff. Or we'll find someone who can. You know what? Stop. We'll get on it right away, sir. You would have just pissed him off more. All right. Well, that could have gone better. Well, and you did. Maybe we should have dragged it out. For what it's worth, I still think it was better to tell him. Yeah, maybe. And you have to oh, smoke cigarettes right now? Oh, doesn't right like people smoking and... Never mind. Smoke away. Lol. Who gets a massage this early? Crane. It doesn't really matter the time of day. The mere scent of stress and he's out the door. Is... Is he gone? Yes. Hey, hopefully. that's... I think I know him. He was a character of Wizard of Oz. Buffkin! Hello, so his Miss name Snow. is Buffkin. Drinking? This early? Where did you get that? It was by Mr. Ichabod's desk. Then don't you think it probably belongs to him? Maybe. How are you today, Mr. Oh, Bigby? Puppy eyes. I should be a good man. Fine, Buffkin. Thanks for asking. Buffkin, get the books. Which books? The ones with all the fables in it. I'm not sure that was any more specific. Bring the first three. Be back in a few minutes. He knows the ones I'm talking about. There's bound to be information on her here. Somewhere. We'll at least be able to get her real name from the books whenever Buff can find them. In the meantime, poke around. Maybe the mirror can help. I really have to get this appointment squared away, but let me know if you need anything. Hello, Vivian. And is that the magic mirror of Snow White's story, which her mother used? Hey, magic mirror. I got yep, a question. I'm correct. You know the rule. I don't have time for this shit. Your impatience is callow. You're needlessly cruel, but have some respect for our history of rules. Listen, guy, one mirror, person mirror. died. Uh, and he mirror. doesn't have any rules. Tell me all about this fable. See? Was that so hard? Ah, uh, yes, that was. About two seconds away from kicking a hole in you. There's no need for that. Fine. Of which fable do you wish to know? I don't know her name. Not yet, anyway. Well, until you do, I can't help you. Let's check Woodsman. Show me the Woodsman. Where is he? 
What you see is complete. The woodsman stumbles down a street. He's drunk. No shit. Which street? I'm sorry, Bigby. I can only show you what can be seen. Show me the woodsman. Show me the woodsman. That's all? Show me Buffkin. Hey! Put down the bottle and get to work! <laughs> Still looking! Show me Snow White. You buffers. Not much of a request. She's in this very room. Nobody right now. Very well. Please return should you wish to ask about someone else. Or someone new. That's all I think. And there he goes. Well, I'm sure we'll get it all cleared up. Okay. Thank you. I'm sorry again for the lag. Where are they? Uh, there is they are. We'll start with these. Any information on fables in our community will be somewhere in these books. It's checking time. It's this stubborn woodsman. My buddy. The woodsman? Yep. And his axe. And I think this is Big B. And there's me. Not a good day. And it's no I'm pretty sure that's supposed to be me. And the seven yeah. drops. Dwarves. Dwarves. The Dwarves. That, the better. What about Red Riding Hood? I didn't see her. Hmm. I think her name was Red. She didn't. So she was killed. Beauty in happier days. And her man, Beast. Funny. There's the two pigs. There's the three pigs. Three little pigs. And his brothers. seen this before. This symbol on the man's clothes, it's the same as the rings. Could be her father, or husband. This has most of the emblems of the old days, and usually what family they come from. If it's in here, we'll have her name. That's Ichabod Crane, I think. Ichabod Crane. Scared. Yep, shit. I was scared. What's that? Your boss. His finest moment. Hard to understand how he ended up running this place. Well, maybe it's time that changed. And that's Headless Ghost, and it's Mr. Toad. Nice hat. And I don't know who he is. I haven't seen Badger around. He likes his privacy, I think. So his bad toad would like his a bit more. Let's check out. can help. Then why is it? Yeah, thanks. We look out for each other. Don't overdo it. Buffkin, translate. Hmm, an exquisite design from the good china of Toad Hall. 
Mr. Toe? He probably wrote this in himself. So here's the symbol. This is the one. Where is this symbol from? Which family or story? That's an odd one. Family name? Alelairo? I'll go look it up. Alelairo. That means every kind of fur in German. Donkey skin. Yes. What does it say? <sighs> donkey skin girl, also known as donkey skin. <laughs> also known as <laughs> ass skin. <laughs> <laughs> it prefers to go by the name Faith. Poetic? Buffkin, we don't need the commentary. The story of Donkey Skin. There was once a great king with a beautiful queen. The queen grew ill and had her husband promise to only marry the most beautiful girl in the kingdom. After a long search, it became clear that the only woman in the land that could match her beauty was... Oh, his daughter, Faith. She had a magic cloak made from the skin of her father's prized donkey that would hide her beauty so she could escape his kingdom. Eventually, she married a prince who could see past the magic cloak and knew her true beauty. And they lived happily ever after. Should I mark it, Miss Snow? Yes. Please. And what's her husband's name? Lawrence. Prince Lawrence. We got what we came for. Yeah. Her name's Faith. She was married to Prince Lawrence. I mean, that's more than her we... name was Faith. Yeah. And there's a name mentioned. You should talk to the husband. Ask him. You think he... Faith. Did? We can't rule him out. Nothing would surprise me at this point. We can't rule him out. I think I know what to do. Let's go to Magic Mirror. Talk with him. Mirror, mirror, blah, blah, Abel, blah, 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 blah. this fable. Blah, 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 blah. Of which fable do you wish to know? Prince Lawrence. He's a prince, I think. Show me Prince Lawrence. Oh, shit. What's he been doing? Where is this? Where's what? Do you know where Prince Lawrence lives? If he's a prince, probably relocated in the South Bronx. Yellow building, red window shutters. Red frames. Yep, that's the one. I can take us there. Show Faith's father. Faith's father. The old king. Ah, he's dead. Guess that crosses him off the suspect list. Nobody right now. Anything we can use? Yeah, that'll have to do for now. Come on, we're going over there. And the bell rings. Sorry, I have to get that. Hello, Woodland's business office. Yes, I... He is. Hold on. Bigby, it's for you. Bigby, it's me, Toad. You there? What do you want? Big B! Shit! Listen, right? There's a bloke upstairs going through all the woodsman's things. Get over here, Big B, before he... Oh, wait, hang on. 
Something is wrong. Boy, shit. Hey! What was that about? Oh, Hard shit. To say. Something going on over at Toad's place. What about Faith's husband? I don't know. I couldn't really tell. But he could be in trouble. And we should go there anyway to search her apartment. Toad might have to wait. Whenever you're ready. So that's all for today. Thanks for the support. For because of your support, I'm making and continuing my video, all these videos. And yeah, I'll be completing the Valiant House Secret Watch. Just that, as because I'm doing the Wolf Among Us right now, I just don't feel feeling good to do it. And yeah, I'll try to improve my stamina problem. And please do watch and like this video and yeah please subscribe my channel and my friends mother dog and fc pack on channel and with that said peace and till next time bye bye